Welcome to Get Fit with Gosha. Today I have a free standing punching bag workout for you. This workout is for beginners. I will take you through some single punches on a bag, kicks, then we're gonna put them into very easy combos and also some conditioning. So this workout is 30 minutes long. You need equipment today, which is your punching bag. You also need hand wraps and gloves. I have MMA gloves. You can have punching bag gloves, anything to protect your hands, your wrists. Beside that, grab your water, towel, good music, good attitude, and let's get this workout on a road. We're gonna start with a short warm up. All right, let's jog here on the spots. Waking up the muscles. Waking up the body. So as you're starting your warm up, make sure your gloves are on already. So you can go right into it. Okay, now big circles for the arms. And change direction. Put a smile on your face. Elbows up, turn the body side to side. And come back to the center, feet together. Breathe in and breathe out. To breathe in and breathe out. Next one, bend forward at the waist. All the way down. Do a good stretch. Stay here for a little bit. Feel the stretch coming up. Do it one more time. Stay here. Coming up. And now one arm up, one down, doesn't matter, 10 on each side. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And next one, circle your hips. This is a total body workout. You're going to feel it everywhere. And change direction. Come back to the center. Circle your knees. Warm up your joints. So I'm going barefoot. Usually when I do a bank workout, I'm used to going barefoot. You can choose, change direction now. You can choose to go with shoes. It's up to you whatever feels more comfortable for you. All right, and circle your ankle. Change direction. And other leg. So this is more of an instructional video. You will get a workout all the way, but this is to learn what to do with a bag. This bag is different than a hanging bag because it really swings, okay? So we're gonna learn how to control the bag. Are you ready to go? Let's do it. So just follow me. We're gonna start with jabs. We're gonna do first part, working on the technique. 45 seconds per exercise. We have 12 of them. Are you ready? Let's go, I'm gonna get my timer. All right, so first, left leg is in front, hands are up, just jabs. So you want to wait for the bag to come back at you and hit it in a moment as it's coming at you. Taking the swinging to your advantage. You can also step into it. So just the jabs here. Right hand is on your face. Turning the shoulders. That's it. Try to hit it in the same spot every time the back comes back at you. Three, two, one. Time. Yes. All right, stop the bag. Now we're going to do crosses. Fighter stance. Hands are up. So now, right side. Three, Ready? Two, Let's go. One. Exercise two. Control the bag. Don't let it control you. And as you're doing that, I'm turning my foot in. 
I'm not hitting hard. Don't worry about hitting hard. You're just learning. Learning to control the bag. That's it. You're doing awesome. Keep going. Do your best. 100% effort. You don't have to be perfect with every punch. Try your best. Time. All right, now we're going to go with hooks. Again, one-sided, single exercise at a time. We're going to go with the left side. Hands are up. Ready? Go. Again, control it. Turn your foot in. When you're doing your punches, you can hold your hand this way or this way. Whatever feels more comfortable for you. Keep going. So now you are close to the bed, so you don't have to reach. You're just lifting your hand up. Make sure you're making a fist with your hand. Otherwise, you're going to feel it in your wrist. Time. Shake it out. All right. Still, right leg in front. Hands are up. Right hook. Okay. Look at your feet. Hip width apart. Ready? Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna go on the other side so you can see me. That's it. Wait for it. Turn your body. Try to hit the same spot. You're doing awesome. Keep going. Your left hand is up on your face. Keep it tucked in. Again, don't worry about how hard you're hitting it. Hit it consistently. Three, two, one. Time. Shake it out. Next one, uppercuts. So uppercuts, right in the middle, we're going to go to the left side first. Five stands. Ready, let's go. Up. Breathe into it. Go. Turn the shoulder. Doing awesome. Keep it going. Focus on your punching bag. Ten seconds to go. And you're starting to feel the shoulder here, right? Time. All right. Changing sides. So I'm just going to come to the other side so you can see me. Your left leg still in front. Now we're going to go with right hook. Here we go. And so right up the cup. Dig into it. Your abs are in tight. All the hands still up. Hold it there. Now we're going to go with knee strikes. So what are you going to do? We're going to go with the left knee strike first. Hold the bag in the middle or on top. Right legs in front. Bring it up. I would just want you to bring it up. For now, hit it slightly on the side. Point the toe. Now, if you want to add some power into it, jump. But focus that on the technique. So just lift, bring it in. Make that knee pointy and point your toes down. Three, two, one. Time. 
Changing your stance. Left leg's in front. Now the right side. Or you here or top. I prefer the top. Let's go. So again, just lift or if you feel comfortable, add a little jump. Hit the side of the bag, not straight in. Slightly on the side. And push. This is good stretch for me. <laughs> Go. Okay, now we're going to go with roundhouse kicks. Okay, we're going to go slowly. Follow me. Okay, your right leg's in front. Hands are up. You're going to turn your foot out first. Kick. Turn the hips. Come back. Okay, you have to control the bed. Find the right climbing. And turn. Take your time. You don't have to do too many kicks. Make sure that your right foot is turned out. And let you turn the hips. And swing the arm. Again, don't worry about the power. That will come later. Okay, I'm gonna stay on the same side. So now you're changing your stance. Hands are up. Soft on the feet, abs in tight. Exercise. Turn your foot out. Kick. Come back. You can leave that foot there so it's turned out all the time. All you're doing is just lift the leg up and pot and kick. Or a kick. Wait for the bag. Again, working with this type of bag is different than the one that's hanging from the ceiling. Harder to control this one. Because it's lighter. All the weight's on the bottom. Three, two, one. Time. Okay. One more move you're going to learn here. It's a teep. Three, Bring your right leg to the front. Hands are up. Left side. Teep. Come back. So all you're gonna do, you're just gonna tap it very lightly. Okay, just tap lightly. Just touch it. Swing your hand, same hand, back. Up. Teep. So what you're doing the contact with is this part, ball of the foot. <coughs> Control it with your core. Hands are up. Time. Changing your stance. Hands are up. Now we're going to go with the right leg. Ready? Let's go. Exercise 12. So you're going to feel better kicking or striking with one leg. Because whatever leg is your dominant one, for me, feels more natural with my right side. I, have, I feel like I have more control on this side. But, we still have to work both sides of the body. So you're able to use both sides. Push. Basic single moves, single punches, single kicks. Now we're gonna do both sided and alternating. Okay? Grab some water. We have 
eight exercises here, 45 seconds long. First one is jab and across. When you do your jab, you don't want to push it so that it's hard to hit it. So just tap it and cross. Okay, so tap lightly, cross. Come. So your jab is more like to control the bag and then the power comes from your cross. All right, get yourself ready. In four, hands are up. Left leg's in front. Here we go. One, two. One, two. One, two. So jab, just control. Beautiful. You can move around a little bit if you feel comfortable. Okay, make sure you're crossing. But on the cross, you're turning your shoulder. Turn your foot in. Time. Yes. All right, now we're going to do alternating knee strikes. They're going to be faster. I call this move the running man. So hold the top or the side. And we're going to move a little bit faster here. Ready? Let's go. You don't have to go hard. Just try to make contact with the bag with every strike. Aim for the side of the bag. Use your hip muscles. And try not to hang on the top. This is just to hold the bag, not for you to be resting on top of the bag. Three, two, one. Time. Yes. Okay, next move. Left side. Hook, uppercut. Okay? Control the bag. Let's try this. Three. Don't punch it too hard. Exercise. Hook, three. uppercut. Hook. Uppercut. So now the bag is moving into all different directions. So you can go one, two, or you can go one by one. One by one. Whatever is easier for you at this point. Feels good, huh? You can add your bag. Time. Now I'm going to switch it up. Now, so your left leg is still in the front. You're going to do uppercut, hook with your right side. Fighter stance. Feet hip width apart. Here we go. Uppercut, hook. So now you have to figure out which way the bag is moving. And let's try to control it. So when you hit hard, it spins out of control. That's why for now, don't hit it too hard. One, two. And again, keep making fists with your hands. Otherwise, if you relax your fists, you're going to have problems with your wrists. Okay, next exercise. Alternating tips. So now, neither leg's in the front. We're just going to lift and tap the bag very lightly. Hands up. Let's go. Left, right, left, right. See, if you push it too hard, it goes out. And then you cannot catch it. Just tap, just tap. Let the bag absorb the shock so it doesn't move. 
Focus on keeping your core nice and tight here. This is what creates the movement. Keep those hands up. Time. Awesome work. All right, now we're going to do alternating uppercuts. We're going to move around the bag a little bit. Heads up. Three, two. Both feet together. No stands. Go. So take it all the way around the bag. Change direction so you don't get dizzy. So this is good exercise to move and punch at the same time. Doing awesome. Keep going, keep going. Three, two, one. Time. Next one. We're going to do alternating kicks. So what are you going to do? You're just going to lift, lift. As you lift, the foot on the bottom is pointed out to the side. So lift, lift. Turn the hips. That's your focus. Focus is the hips. Turning, left and right. Just for the kick. You first lift the hips. And then the leg goes up. Again, don't hit too hard. So you're going to spin it out of control. Still getting a good workout here. Time. Okay. Last exercise for this round. Round two. Fast jab cross. But the jab cross are more like body punches. So you're gonna keep it at the body level. Let's go. Move around. And then other way. Keep going, keep going. Come on. Now I can go light, but go fast. Ten more seconds, come on. Time. Okay, that was two rounds. Now we're going to get into, this is called conditioning. So we're going to combine it with burpees and other fun exercises. Have some water first. Make sure you hydrate. Okay. Exercise one. You're going to do jab, cross, jab, cross. Come into a burpee. Stand up. Okay, just gonna find enough space. When you do your jab cross, don't go too hard. Just tap it lightly. Okay, hands are up, fire stance. Measure the distance so you're not too close, not too far. Make sure you can reach. One minute, let's go. Just hot work is good enough. Now 
again and our way up. Now this is the real workout. The other one was technique. Next one, four alternating knee strikes, two kicks on each side. Whew. Okay, hold the top, get ready, four of those, let's go. One, two, three, four, whatever side you want. One, two, continue. Now other side, one, two, one. Four. Four. Do your best. You don't need to be perfect. Just keep moving. Feeling good. Yeah. I just wish I wore shoes today, because my floor very, is very hard. Time. Last exercise, you're gonna get yourself in a plank. If you have MMA gloves, you can go on your hands. If you have boxing gloves, you go on your knuckles. Plank position, punch. Punch the bottom of your bag. Stay in the plank. Up and lift. Working the core muscles. Come on, let's go. Exercises. Take a break. You have 30 second recovery. Do a little stretch. Drink water. Let's do it one more time. So now, try to push yourself a bit more. Try to go a bit faster. Last three minutes. Then you're done. Three. Ready? Let's go. Exercise. One, two, three, four. Half burpee or sprawl. You can call it a sprawl also. Come on, let's keep moving. Move the body. Your last cross can be hard. Because then you get down to the floor. Make sure you don't get knocked out by a bag. <laughs> Come on, keep pushing. Ten seconds. Hands up. Three, two, Last one here. Woo! That's it. Okay, next one. Knee strikes, two kicks. Hands on top. Whatever leg you want to start with. Let's go. Exercise. Two, three, four. Come 
Come on, 10 seconds. Stretch your body out. Let's do it together. Stretch your quads. So comment down below how you like, how you found this workout. If you would like more of this type of workout, I'll be more than happy to do another punching bag workout. All right, hands behind you. Leg forward. Hard to keep my hands together with those big gloves. Lift up, relax your head. Now let your arms go. Come all the way down. Palms down to the floor. Step into downward dog. Stretch out your calves. Breathe. I'm getting sweat in my eyes. All right, now jump your legs together. Come into a low squat. Feel the stretch so you guys can see me. Uh, stretching out your Achilles tendon. And at the same time, push your legs out. And coming up slowly, rolling up your shoulders. Roll them back, relax, and a few rolls forward. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for working out with me and sweating with me. I think my mascara is running a little bit, that's okay. If you haven't done so yet, press that red button, subscribe so you get a notification when I upload another workout kickboxing or Muay Thai or bag workout. So, see you later. Adios. Thanks, Thanks for watching. Subscribe, Subscribe to Get Fit with Gosha and like our videos.